Morning fellas on YouTube. This video is a brief description of my hydraulic angle conversion on my Kubota Snowblade here. Model is TG2754. Uh, this model doesn't come equipped with provisions to add hydraulic angle <clears throat> out of the factory. So I went ahead to the mod, saw a couple of ideas online. Other guys have done this too. I just thought I'd share how I did it. So let's get started. I used a one and a half inch bore hydraulic cylinder with a four inch stroke. The pin uh, is offset about five inches from the main pivot on your coupler. I used a piece of two by two tubing mitered and capped off there uh, with a bushing drilled through the uh, end here and at which holds the pin. So on the back end here, I've yet to add the bronze bushings and a spacer required right there. And this is all held captive with a couple of uh, AN bolts tapped into that 3 16 thickness cap. At the front, you can see the uh, bronze bushings I have installed uh, with the uh, pin going all the way through to the bottom. So that's well supported and it's well supported in double shear as well. Otherwise, the hoses go back to the tractor ports. So I used a couple of tire wraps color coded to match the coating on the aux ports on the tractor itself. Otherwise, uh, it doesn't angle to the full left right, and the reason being is on the GF1800, when we go full left, we come in contact with the lift arms. So, well, we got a visitor. Hey, bud. Anyway, there's no point to make it go all the way to the left because it'll just come in contact with the lift arms and it'll bend the blade forward. So uh, we go almost all the way, and we're out by about half a hole here once the cylinder is fully retracted. Otherwise, if you buy the uh, BX60 blade with all the provisions included, uh, it's going to be about $1,500 and the cylinder is another $600 or so. So it's about, call it $2,500 out the door. And if you buy the blade like so and add on all your components, it's going to be about, let's call it uh, just over $1,000 if you, uh, you want to do it yourself. Otherwise, uh, that's all we got here. Uh, it's much easier to move snow around when you have hydraulic angle. And uh, definitely recommend this if uh, you have the skill set or if, uh, if you like this idea here and uh, you know someone can get it done for you. All right, thanks for watching.